The camera is at the center of my films. If I use a new one, I need to see how it performs in real life and what that new tech can do for my creative. I'm making this ad and it's focused on the performance of a bike and an athlete. I need to capture the speed, the control, the drive and the determination. Usually for a shoot like this, I will need several bodies carefully selected for each setup. But making this film was different because the EOS C50 is different. I was surprised how dark it was in the tunnel. We used the highest based ISO, which is 6400, but we pushed it even more to 12,800, and it was still incredibly clean. Shooting 7K RAW on an open gate sensor gave us so many options for social media and all these cuts. It's great to play with. Tracking looks good. Do the next shot. Nice one. Thanks, man. Shooting, cycling from a car can be kind of tricky. All right, guys, we good to go? The car is moving, the bike is moving like left and right, and doing the focus in this case can be really something difficult. So the way to control this setup was from a tablet inside the car, and it was great to have everything at the same place. It was so easy to control the zoom, the focus. Uh, we had access to the aperture and everything. Get boost! Face detection was great was really following his face very well. Just a, just a pleasure to, to work with. Just check the camera quick. And so we're here for the second part of the shoot. We're in a studio to capture some dreamy cinematic shot to be in a kind of abstract world. We're going to use a robot, so we're going to play with lights a lot, with movements, with different lens ratio, to use the Summer Prime lens and some anamorphic and RF. Okay, camera. Shift. Three, two, one, action. We shot few sequences already, and uh, the image quality and the, the result is just it's stunning. Shift or anything, just like a regular uh, dynamic race. range is really, really great. The natural colors, the skin tones, it's, it's beautiful. The feeling I would like to capture today is to have our athlete really pushing hard his training, like pure action, something strong. Yeah, Usually in a project, I think it's really interesting, creatively, to mix lenses. So I will use anamorphic, but not only. And shooting the full height of the sensor gets everything out of anamorphic lenses. The goal of it is to have different texture to play with, different aspect ratio. Even as a filmmaker, I love shooting stills. Yeah, perfect. And what is great about this camera, it's from the flick of a switch, I can change from professional video to high quality stills. I put a lot of importance on the audio in my edits. Usually it's something that I really love to work with. So we were able to capture all our sound design directly on set. The light is getting really good, and we're going to put this beast on a FPV drone. And then you dive. We're going to get some sick cinematic shot from this guy. One. All right, let's do it. I get some really cool angle, really good speed with this FPV. Yeah, it looks it looks very different than any action camera that I used to work with. We tried so many things with this camera today, and it's honestly beyond our uh, expectations. The fact that it's that small with this quality, it's, it's stunning. Stop, 
personally what I love about this camera, it's the fact that it's so small, so light, but with everything of a professional camera in it. So all the features that I need, the unlimited raw recording, the time code, the waveform, and you're still able to do some stills. The C50 has delivered in every single scenario. That's a wrap, guys. If I had to choose just one camera, this would be it.